Ladies and gentlemen, Salam Mike, Avi Lou, and we're here with the official world's final say. There's no argument, protein bar tier list. You can go watch another video with all your internet supplement sponsored shills, but we're the official. We have no relation to any of these folks, and we're going to give it to you raw. <laughs> oh, baby, I like it raw. Yeah, so we're going to go by taste and a very little bit of nutrition on the side. Mm -hmm. um, if something's ridiculously out of the range of nutrition, we'll mention it. Mm -hmm. um, but otherwise, we're mostly going by taste. Let's get started. Hit them, Abby. Where are we starting? This one. Um, what is this? No cow dipped. I mean, As like Abby mentioned, peanut butter. it is on sale. And yeah. that is a little bit of a red flag. But I'm going to go into this blind and open-hearted and open-minded. Okay, oh, what are our macros? It's actually not stiff. I thought it was going to be really hard to break. Um, what are our macros? 200 cows, 7 fat, 26 carbs, and 20 protein. Again, pretty standard bad, protein yeah. bar by nowadays. It smells like a protein bar. What's our flavor? <laughs> it's so dry. It's dry, I'm happy. Chocolate, peanut butter? I taste sugar, alcohol, and mm -hmm. that's it. I got mine. On the count of three, ready? Oh, fine. Ready? One, two, three. Am good I eating chalk? But, oh. <laughs> good butt. You gave a good butt? Yeah. At All first, right. I was there too. Am I eating chalk? But then it's like, it's not that bad. So I've, I've lived through the years of protein bar hell. And I came out alive. And so now I just hold a higher standard of what my protein bar is. Mm -hmm. So I think if you give me that mm -hmm. 10 years ago even, mm -hmm. I would say it's above average. 10 years ago. I'm going to change it. Jim, I eating chalk. Okay, we're going chalk. <laughs> All right, dump her in the chalk. Dump her in the chalk. What's our next one? All right, let's go with the fit snack. Another one that's on sale. <laughs> is it? Oh, that is a bad sign. Yeah, it's a bad sign. I know the texture. Okay. I could feel it through the bar. Oh, so, yeah. But, so it does have that crunch action going on. Yeah, we should do a close-up, huh? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. So what some the of them... Heck? Some of them have tried to do this texture. I know we have a couple more like that, where it's like the waffle crisps yeah. uh, surrounded by some kind of white stuffs and the chocolate. What's our macros? I think our macros are right in the pocket. Okay. 190 calories. A little bit less. So 8 fat, 17 carbs, 16 protein. All right. So about the same. Like I said, yeah. we're kind of in this range of everything. Oh, God. I think it's fail. A oh, while wow, he's got no taste, man. Okay, I don't know if we can judge it properly because I feel like it just went bad. I don't think it went bad. So I think the issue with this list is we don't have anything that's just like not good. Like shouldn't even be a protein bar in my head. Are we considering that anything? Because in my head that means macros. Right. That's just the F tier. So I'm probably putting this there. Yeah, no, the crisp part too. It's not even like crispy, it's chewy. That's what I mean, like it, it's like so yeah. stale. It's not like Rice Krispie Chewy either though. Cause like Rice no. Krispie Chewy, yummy. How have they not made a Rice Krispie protein bar? That would hit. Yeah. You could do it too, like, I don't you know. You can do it. I can do it. This one. Oh, the one boy. One bars, one bars are really good. One bars are pretty yeah. popular, I feel like. Um, Something on their branding, I feel like they made like the holistic look. Like it looks healthy. Yeah. Where it's old clean. school protein bars, you know, look like muscle and yeah. lights and. Oh, okay. Short and good. flat. This is a chocolate peanut butter one. Macros are about cup. the same as everything else, yeah. I think. Yeah. Well, 230. So it's on the higher side for calories. 20 grams of protein, 9 fat, 24 carbs. Yeah. Mm. What we got? Chocolate okay. protein? Mmm. There's peanut pizzas in here. What'd you say? Are you paid by them? No. Oh, wait, wait. Is chocolate peanut butter? Mm-hmm. Texture, I would say, is better than the rest so far, mm -hmm. but still very old school protein bar. Yeah. Like it tastes like, it, like my ideal protein bar is that it just tastes good. Mm -hmm. I don't want to bite it with a blindfold and be like, oh yeah, that's a protein bar, mm -hmm. right? Because no one wants a protein bar. It's hard to do that. It's very hard to do that. Mm -hmm. But we want something yummy, right? That tastes like, that has protein in it. That's what a protein bar is to me. It's a yummy bar that has protein macros. All these bars, there's kind of lack of flavor. Mm -hmm. They're all kind of bland. And it's still the highest amount of calories so far. 230. I'm probably giving it a good butt. All right, I'm taking Abby down memory lane. The metrics bar. 
There's an apple crisp one that bangs. That sounds good. Uh, but this one isn't my favorite, the super cookie. There used to be one that was like a fudge cream deal, so it has this cream layer, and it was more fudgy. But this one's solid. This, this does lean more towards like a meal replacement This bar. is huge. So we got yeah. 410 calories, 13 fat, 40 carb, and like 30 protein. Look at the size comparison yeah. there. But it's almost more by size probably yeah. than like macro oh, density, right? right? Because they're literally, it's, it's literally bigger. double... It, Twice as long and thicker mm-hmm. than the other ones. 10 calories. It's a whole meal. Yeah, or this is a huge two-inch bar. We got this frosting. It's obviously dense because it's probably got protein in it. But then at least we have a mini chocolate layer going, and then kind of a hard, uh, crisp-like inside. It smells like chocolate. Mm. That's pretty good. Pretty good, right? Mm-hmm. It definitely ha- it's like an old school formula, so you can kind of taste like. I have an extremely talented palate, so try to keep up. I taste cinnamon. So there's a little bit of cinnamon, but yeah. you can almost taste the cold because of the sugar alcohol. I can taste a little cold on my tongue. Cold. Cold. What does that mean? Sugar alcohol. You know, alcohol like evaporates and it's like kind of cold, or like gum sometimes cold. What is he talking about? I'm right, huh? I don't know what you're talking about, but I do taste cinnamon. Chocolate's good. The, there's the crunch, it, the, the crisp in there is good. And the frosting's good. It's yeah. like a good chewy to add to the crunch. Mm-hmm. What are you giving it? Really? What are you doing? Above average. All right. I'll, 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 I'm down with it. I'm down with above average. But I, I'd probably give it, yeah, I'd probably give it, it does the job for now. It doesn't scream protein bar to me, you know, like, that's which true. Is a good thing. Yeah, it's not, yeah, the textures are a little, you know, on their own. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm down with it. I'm down with above average. I'm down. Okay. A quest bar. Okay, the new and improved Quest Bar. I heard they've been changing formulas around. They have both. All right, we got both. So we have the Quest Hero, which I've just heard, I've never actually tried this one. I've heard word on the street, the Quest Hero's it. Uh, 15 grams of protein. A little low. Kind of looks like a turd. Oops, 190 cows. Eight fat, 29 carb, 15 protein. So yeah, a little low on the protein, but again, kind of in the pocket this one a, a lot of people seem to be going with that crispy wafer shit yeah. i wonder why that is we're texture? back maybe back in the day it used to be more of the dense fudgy stuff maybe texture and then calorically is not exact. Like mm. actually tastes like chocolate we got some flavor going on mm-hmm. what's the flavor chocolate caramel pecan. pecan that's a little more normal i guess i, I would agree so like you get the initial right and then you get like the the chewiness and then you get an aftertaste the aftertaste is actually good, mm-hmm. which is typically the worst part of a protein bar, right? Aftertaste normally lingers. Yeah, it is a little bit closer to Rice Krispies for sure. The Krispies actually taste crispy. It's pretty sweet. I think it's the sweetest one so far. A lot of the other ones were really flavorless, huh? Mm-hmm. And I haven't eaten all morning. Do you eat? No. So clean palates. Mm-hmm. Um, that one's pretty good. I'm, I might go. I, we can't throw our god tier. I would definitely put above average. Above average for sure. God tier, we'll see, I guess. I, I, I don't know if it's fair to change things as we move. Because, like, if the rest of them are trash, that's a God's tier. Mm-hmm. Um, but as of right now, it's definitely above average. None of these am I choosing to snack on. Another quest. We're going on the Quest kick. We'll get them all out of the way. The Quest Frosted Cookie. 11 protein, not a lot going on. 13 exactly. fat, 18 carb. But this is obviously trying to be a cookie. And so it's kind of taken the spot of a wow. hostess, I guess, right? This is like a host, you know, hostess. Yeah. This is like a hostess deal, right? Yeah, there's like a piece of cardboard on the bottom. Yeah, of it. yeah, very hostessy. Okay. It smells like a cookie. I ripped it. Oh, it smells like a cookie. Mm-hmm. It smells like um, Sorry, those gas station donuts you get. This is good. It has that waxy chocolate that like those gas station. Do it, it tastes very similar. That's pretty good. Mm-hmm. That kind of tastes like a donut from a gas station. And I know that sounds like a low standard, but those things are okay. Man, I, I almost wish it. there was a deal in between God tier and above average. Because th- th- there should be, right? There should be like a good. Yeah. Like that's good. I, again, I'm not throwing a God tier. So what we do too, Abby, is we can throw within... So if we agree this is above average mm-hmm. and not God tier, mm-hmm. then the order of God t- or above average matters. Okay. So I would put this first in the above average. Okay. Does I that agree. make sense? Yeah. Like it's better than the other oh, two, yeah. but I don't know if it's God tier. 
God tier, you know what I mean? You gotta earn your rights around here. Right. You can't just be called God for no reason. Everyone's yeah, calling so. everyone the goat. Oh, Everyone's God. saying everything's God tier and yes. goaded. Have some standards on the internet. Have some fucking standards. Double chocolate chunk, 20 grams protein. You said you've never really had a regular quest. Not really, no. 170 uh, cows. Yep. Seven fat, 24 carbs. And a bunch it's of fiber. Very, yeah. yeah, very standard. Oh. I feel like they made the standard of that macro breakdown mm-hmm. and everyone tried to match it because before that it was more like that metrics bar. They're so high. This is m- what I'm more familiar with. Oh, they got ch- real chocolate chunks. Yeah. So Quest Bar also, because they blew up, man. Like we worked with them back in the day, like 2012. They blew up and they made a good bar. But then I feel like they went through different recipes. Mm-hmm. So every once in a while, people, the word on the street will be like, man, Quest recipe's not good right now. Or man, they just revamped it, it's really good right now. So I wonder where we're sitting. M- more recently, I've heard that Quest is back back in the game. 170 is pretty good for a big bar. This is one of those OG protein bars. Like, the, Have you had the Costco protein bar? No, but I don't know what you mean, like the texture. The texture is that like, what do you call this? Like Play-Doh-y? Play-Doh. <laughs> yeah. And it's like a whisper of chocolate. Mm-hmm. It kind of tastes like chocolate LaCroix. Mm. It's a little chalky. A little bit. Mm. Does the job? I want to say it does a job, but I think it's like not that high. <laughs> Damn, down there by the one? I could put it by the one. The one and them are, in my head, previous to today, were very similar. It's good butt. Yeah, good yeah. butt. Good butt. Our dark horse. Oh, let's do it. So we wow. found a Cinnamon Toast Crunch protein bar. Now I've seen cereal bars that are just like 30 carb and nothing else. Um, this one has uh, nine fat, 22 carb, 20 protein. Oh, texture's decent. All right, so basically we got a cinnamon looking frosting. This is kind of actually like the metrics bar. It's kind of pretty. No, it's like the metrics bar. So we have a we have a light cream with a caramel drizzle up top. Wait, with crumbs on the top of it. Yeah, yeah, this is fancy. This it is gourmet. Good. General Mills, the GM, knows how to do it, bruh. And then we got it dipped in caramel underneath. Mm. Oh, very, very cinnamony. Mm-hmm. That screams flavor. I'm on a roller coaster ride of flavor right now. Oh, and then it gets too sweet. There's a, it's cold. Don't you feel the cold? I bet you there's sugar alcohol, dude. Oh, definitely. I taste the sugar alcohol. That's the cold. I don't taste. It's like, oh, my tongue. Uh, little ice fairies are dancing on my tongue. For me, it's like an aftertaste thing. Oh, yeah. That's really sweet. That's really sweet. The frosting is too sweet. How did you do that to a protein bar? How many calories is in this? 200 or something? Yeah. 220? I don't know if it's heading to God tier because it's still got Above some weird average. tastes going on. I might throw that up in there. Is that, it average? It's either like lowest tier God tier or top tier above average for me. Above the Quest cookie? I think so. That was almost a little too bland. And mm-hmm. and if I take and for the bonus points, the macros. Okay. I would say if you have to eat a protein bar, you want something to like to indulge in. Yeah. That's a good one. Right? Yeah. The macros are pretty good. Yeah, if you're actually dieting yeah. and you you're just eating dry ass chicken yeah. all day that and you need is, sweet. Yeah. That'll That's hit you. Definitely. I agree that it's probably too sweet and the flavors still aren't very distinct. Mm -hmm. It's like a fake cinnamon taste. It's Mm -hmm. not a real cinnamon taste. It does taste good. But it has real flavor. Where a lot of these ain't flavored up. It's more filling. I think the cookie is probably not going to be as sweet. It feels so light and you get two pieces. And the macros were just kind of. This whole bar is like. All right, I'm down with whatever you want. Above above average. average. Top above average? Yeah. Probably the top of above average for our cereal friend. I've heard good things, dude. It's legendary foods. Cinnamon roll. I've never seen something like this before. I've heard good things of Legendary. I think they're on the come up. I tried their 20 grams sh- protein. strawberry pop tart. Mm-hmm. I put it on my Instagram story and everyone says oh. the cinnamon rolls bang. That's why I got a chocolate one. This Sin- is, okay. Same company. Everyone says it's good. And and I'm trying to go in unbiased. And obviously we're tasting these all back to back. That looks real. You're the cinnamon toast or the cinnamon <laughs> uh, bun queen. Yeah, I made some. Okay, I made a roll. Let's see. Uh, 200 calories, 10 fat, 22 carb, 20 protein. Oh, I got so, no cinnamon. I'm again, skipping that one. Very like basic. Uh, that one's got no cinnamon. Bar. No one needs to eat that. But density is pretty good. The, the frosting feels plasticky, but. Mm. Not what I expected, but don't hate it. Mm. I like it. I like it too. Yeah. Maybe it's unfair because they just said like protein bar 
and flipped the game mm -hmm. and went a whole different route. Mm -hmm. But for me, the macros are so similar to these other bars. Why wouldn't you experiment with a whole new texture? That texture is like a, it is similar to a cinnamon roll. Like yeah. the chewiness. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Where protein bars just, the texture is always going to be no. gross. Yeah, this is good. That's pretty good. That surprised me. I'm going to eat the one without cinnamon. Sweet. I could have that for breakfast. Mm -hmm. Warm it up. Again, it ain't a cinnamon roll from what's the store in fucking the malls? Cinnabon. Yeah, it ain't Cinnabon, but it's pretty good. Mm -mm, it's good. Is it worthy of God tier? Oh, man. I might say yeah. I think so. I might say yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it might be the first one mm -hmm. to have earned it. So Legendary Foods uh, won Abby's heart over. I got a. I oh, got they didn't a have the cinnamon roll? They only had Pop-Tart? No. All right, so we added the cinnamon roll to the list. Um, and now we're going straight pop tart. Look at the look at the the macros. Oh, what? Relax. One hundred and eighty. So it's lower than most. One hundred and eighty calories, eight fat, twenty four carb, and twenty protein. That's pretty good. Yeah, it's very doughy, very pillowy. Almost too pillowy. Too pillowy. Yeah, I think okay. it's too pillowy for a pop tart. It's more oh, pillowy. Right. I forget it's a pop tart. Yeah, it's more pillowy than the cinnamon roll. Yeah, but it's a like better texture for a protein bar. Very typical chocolate flavor. Like it you're not more like you're eating something that was actually baked. Yeah. Versus like, like uh, what is it called? Synthetic. Yeah, like. they, they taste like clay, mm -hmm. right? Like every protein bar's texture, like it feels gummy. Like wet, yeah, wet gummy clay in your mouth. And then or or chalky and dry. Yeah. It's not my favorite. I still but might. I might still might throw it above average. Really. Mm. It might be above average. I don't know if it's allowed to bottom. be said because I wanted to be as neutral as I can, but like, this is like the average protein bar to me. Okay. I don't know if you've had that, but I, I've had this for we'll years. We'll try that next. We'll try yeah. That next. And this is like the average protein bar. Not great, not bad, reliable, decent macros, tastes solid. I it's, low key, confession, I really like mint chip ice cream. And sometimes I feel judged for that. I feel like it's a popular thing. I. It's like we hate it because, um, well, I don't hate it, but People. mint tastes like. Yeah. It reminds me of toothpaste. Right. So I get that. Smell that. It smell. I could smell it from here. It smells like those no. Andes mints you get at a at a it wannabe does. classy restaurant. Yeah. So it's just what covered in chocolate, and just, then you have two layers inside. Yeah, we got like a, a proteiny fudgy and a crispy. They try to do mm -hmm. both on the this crispy. Guy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I can't even. You know what? This low key tastes like the shit version. Hmm. Uh, Girl Scout Thin Mints. Mm -hmm. Oh no, she hates it. Mm -hmm. You've had it. It's good. It's yeah, good. It's good. The right? The chocolate is better than that Pop Tart thing. True. Yeah. The flavors are really good on that, actually, the mint one. I'll let you judge that one because this one's like my go to oh. protein bar. We could put it a bottom of above average or does the job. Yeah, I agree. Which one do you think? I would say it does the job just because it's a lonely category. Next, we got a built bar, which I've actually heard good things about and I've never tried. Built, I think, started as like an amino acid or something. No way. 130 calories. Wow. Too fat. That's good. 17 protein, 18 carb. So, by stats, this is by far the best. I've yeah. never, I didn't know it was that low in protein. Okay, we'll see if it's worth it. Oh, no. That shit. Chewy, dog. Oh. Cool. I can't rip it. Yeah, you can. No, I can't. Look, it's growing. <laughs> <laughs> twist it. I twisted it. Yep. Just keep, That's keep crazy. Twisting. What the heck? So this whole innards. Oh, no. People, I swear someone told me this was good. It smells. It looks like earwax. Like, like the worst kind <laughs> of fake chocolate we are talking about. Maybe we shouldn't smell it. Oh, what is that smell? It's not good. Just to like chocolate. No, there is a smell and I can't describe it that good, but it's not good. Definitely fake. Am I supposed to eat this? Yeah, I don't I really want it. to. Okay. The texture no, is extremely we... chewy, but you know you like rip apart like a cheesy deal or Rough. you rip apart like a good caramel bar and there's something good happening. This is not it. No. Okay. All right. Cheers, dude. <laughs> Did you even take a bite? Bro. What is that texture? I can't chew this. 
It's very fake sugar. We need a spit bucket. What is that? It tastes like plastic. But that Rip. that caramel chewy. Thing, oh, that's worse. It got slimy once like my saliva touched it. Keep chewing, it gets worse. You know what I mean? The though? flavor's d bad. No, that was not good. I mean, I'd eat it. No. If I'm desperate at an expo, I've eaten some crazy shit, you no. know? Okay. Sometimes you gotta put some crazy shit in your mouth in desperate times. How desperate could you possibly be? I'm real hungry. I've been grinding 10 hours in a booth, you know? That's it's that, not that, good. You should be it shouldn't be called a protein bar. No. But the stats are so good. That's why. Because they sacrifice all the flavor. What is this? Built. I'm sorry, Built. You should rethink what we're doing. No, you should rethink everything. I swear somebody told me that's good. Oh my god, I've never... Salted caramel. Because this... Which we'll go to next to cleanse my fucking palate. This salted protein bar, the caramel cashew, Bear Bell, I already know, right. is the greatest protein bar of all time. Unless one of these come out of nowhere, but just by this label, I'm telling you this one's not coming. Mm -hmm. This is the best protein bar, and I've never eaten it in this sense. So, extra chewy, which you don't expect. There's car like literal caramel on it. Once you rip the top, there's caramel underneath the shell, like a tiny amount, but kind of like a uh, Three Musketeers. Who's got that? Milky Way. Milky like Way. a very. This is uh, the texture of this is like a very off ratio Milky Way. It's like a nougat kind of. There's a baby nougat, a lot of car, a uh, minimal amount of caramel, and then yeah, like the regular shit. Mm. It's only hard to break because it was in the fridge. That's true. Mm. Bear is good. Not overpowering. Creamy. Creamy, but chewy in a good way. You don't get a lot of creamy. If you want to get through a protein bar, it needs to be a little more neutral. A balance, yeah. Yeah, and that one just does it so good. The, the aftertaste is a hair chalky. It is a protein bar. Mm -hmm. We didn't read the macros. They are good. The 200 caramel. calorie, 8 fat, 18 carb with 3 fiber and 20 protein. So this actually has the best macros. The more protein than carbs. And 200 calories are pretty standard. The caramel is good too. The caramel is legitimate. Taste. It might be like real caramel. You know, it's not all crazy yeah. waxy. That might be God tier for me based on this list. Pure protein is like an OG. <laughs> I feel like um, they're an OG because they try to take the meathead protein bar and then they label it kind of mom style, you know? Like uh -huh. you can see this in like a soccer mom's. Reminds me of thing. Costco because I think yeah. it's at Costco. Yeah. Time. 180. Oh, good macros actually. 180 calories, four fat. 17 carb, 21 protein. It's gonna be bad, dude. I don't feel good. <laughs> I gotta do a fat workout after this too. This is a- Texture's insanely typical. Looks chalky. Bare bones fudge frosting. Did oh, you got a chocolate chip. Yeah. You stole mine. <laughs> I got a whole You're the mine. one who broke it. <laughs> My chocolate chip. Um, yeah, this is like a brick. Very chalky like all the way through, but some chocolate chips. But these chocolate chips might be fake, you know? There's no way that's good. It's okay. I'm out. Actually, the chocolate mm -hmm. for that world is pretty good. It's good. No, if you got a chocolate chunk in I there, definitely just judged the book by the cover. I apologize. It might be the best chocolate flavoring so far. Mm. Wait, this has like three chocolate chips in it. I can't. Oh, I got a tummy ache. <laughs> oh my God. It's gonna be the best piece. I'm about to throw up. I'm about to throw up. Hates me. What Texture is, is wet, chewy, and chalky at the same time. Didn't I know think that could happen. It does the job. You think it's that good? The chocolate itself is. That's what I mean. But like, the texture is wild. I don't think it's the worst texture. I think if you're used to the Quest, the old like Quest bar, the Kirkland protein bar, like that chewiness, it's kind of pretty similar. Aftertaste is, isn't hot. I'll give it that. I would say for me, it would be the high. Yeah, I'm down with it. Does the job. Good butt but I think it's below good. my my builder. Oh, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. True. But it could be. It could be. It does the job below that. The macros are really good. That's like chicken breast macros. Okay, so I think it puts it up there below I, the builders. I'd be down with that. I'm down with that. All right. I was trying to get us Power Crunch. Have you had Power Crunch? Yeah. Power Crunch is one of my favorites, actually. Um, it's more of a wafer bar. Again, like. All right, everyone knows what a protein bar is. How can we make it better or different? Mm -hmm. And that's why I think that cinnamon roll made it so high on our list. 
I was at the store and trying to get the uh, power crunch. I couldn't find it, but they said this optimum nutrition is a similar wafer. It's a protein wafer. It's big. Yeah, it's really big. It's thick and big. Okay. <laughs> it's 210 calories, 10 fat, 14 carb, 15 protein. Okay. Oh, it's pretty. Oh, it's two pieces. I think it's split into two pieces. Wow. That's pretty good, right? That looks, I mean, yeah. To the eye, that's crazy. Like, oh, it smells like cardboard. Oh, I love cardboard. Give me. It's hard crunch. <laughs> it's hard to rip it apart. Airy protein snack wafer. Does it even have a flavor? Wait, that's good. Chocolate creme. No way. Eat it. Y'all ever eat those cookies? What? Cookie? There's a wafer cookie that's just like that. Are wafers cookies? It's not too flavorful. So yeah, for protein bar macros or whatever. Hit me, what you think it is? No, it's good. I need a drink, dude. Me too. My stomach hurts. Above average? I'm down with above average. I might even put it above the metrics bar for taste. Mm. That cinnamon roll just slaps them though, right? I've heard of these. It's a brownie. Eat me. Guilt-free protein brownie. Are they going sexual with it? Chocolate. Mm, I think it's up to you. No, for sure. Oh, the the icon or whatever is like lips um, bite. <laughs> it's like the bite, the lip emote. And it says, eat me. Okay. Wait, 186 calories. I've never seen that before. That's accurate because most people round up. You can round up in, in this game. 10 fat, 10 carb, 14 protein. That's where like you guys don't know, but like if your macros don't match your calories on your labels because the FDA allows them to round up. Ooh. That looks like a brownie. That looks like a whole ass brownie. That looks like a whole ass brownie. Is there a layer on Eat top? Eat me. It's like a chocolate layer on top. Eat me. Texture looks pretty good. Eat me. All right. <laughs> Last piece. Oh, texture's a brownie. Yeah. Texture is a brownie. A little foamy, maybe? Like spongy? Yeah, spongy, spongy. A little spongy, maybe? But that's a brownie, dog. All right. I don't know, dude. Uh oh. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. A little crumbly and a little bit of fake chocolate going on. Tastes like a chocolate cake. It tastes more cakey than brownie because of the texture. It's it a little dry in the back of my throat. A little dry. Where are you putting it though? Mm. Above average? Yeah. I don't know which one. It might be above the, the metrics for me. Okay. I mean, it's up to you though. There. Yeah, I like it. I think if you dress it up, it could probably sneak its way into God tier. Yeah. You could put on a if plate. If you dressed it up. Yeah. We did the best we could, but hopefully we give you guys a good idea, an honest review of the tier list. Comment below some of your favorite protein bars. Be sure to follow Avi, avi.lu on Instagram. I'm Salah Mike. New videos every single day. If y'all enjoy this type of video, man, be sure to comment, be sure to like, and be sure to share with your friends. More tier lists on the way. Next week, we got energy drinks. And we're going to give it to you raw. <laughs> Is that what the series is called? Maybe. Give it to you raw. Mikey raw. Mikey. Oh. Rawr. Mm. <laughs> Catch you all the next Rawr one. Rawr XD. 3SB.co for all your clothing.